Hey guys, uh, let's make this intro quick. So we are doing the 200 pound pop blaster upgrade kit. We are doing, sorry, I dropped my little button for the phone. Uh, we are doing two versions. We're gonna just go over the cheap version uh, using pipe fittings. Uh, if you look down in the description, you'll see what fittings you need for a Harbor Freight one and for an Eastwood one. There's only slight differences. Um, then we're gonna put on the actual one that we're keeping on it, which is a mirror blaster setup. Uh, that's the one we're gonna keep on the pressure pot. Uh, reason is, is because a mirror blast also makes a kit that goes on to our blast cabinet and it stays in a blast cabinet. So you just switch a hose and pull it off. If you pull it off, you got the portable, you put it on and then it goes through your cabinet. Uh, just a lot more easier, a lot more efficient. Uh, besides that, in this video, we have some interesting videos coming up here eventually. Uh, my buddy has some rims that he's doing. Uh, they were shitty. They're actually not looking bad now. I think he has two more to blast. Uh, he comes down on his days off to take care of that. Uh, we ended up getting this metal grate. Uh, we have a cut. Yeah, it's kind of freaking huge. Uh, we have a customer that wants to turn that into a table. So right now we're trying to look for a blue epoxy um, coating for it um, or powder for it. Uh, we're having a hard time finding blue for them. Um, yes, we still have these just waiting on powder. Like for some reason, we're just having a hard time getting that powder in. We also have a sink, enamel sink, that we just blasted. We've never done enamel before. Um, right there. We've never done enamel before, so uh, that one's kind of a weird one. I checked with Prismatic. They said that we can powder coat it, so we're gonna try to epoxy coat it. Uh, got some valve covers. If anybody is looking for a uh, system, we are selling the X1 uh, powder coating system. Uh, we sell it at cost, no markup. Uh, we basically get you in touch with our rep at the factory and you deal with her, no middleman, no markup. So uh, just let me know if you're interested in that. Like I said, any parts and stuff should be down in the description. So uh, we hope you like the video. So tonight we are doing the upgrade kit. Right here is a cheap way to do it. It's gonna be a T, they're all half inch. You're gonna have a barb on the end. You're gonna have a 45. Again, half inch, male and female. All these parts are down in the description. Just click on the links with a barb here. And this is pretty much a cheap upgrade kit going to half inch, half inch barrel. Then half inch ball valve. And then the last thing is another half inch barrel. I actually can't use it because I already bent that. So it'd be a half inch barrel you put it here and then basically this will go up to your air and this will come out from your hose. Um, that's a quick setup. Like I said, all these pieces are down in the description. But what we are going to do is the Ameritrade upgrade kit. So we're going to start with this lower feeder. And basically it just has a barb on it.
comes with this kit. It's a half inch hose, two ply for 250 PSI. Of course, first one we're gonna do. So instead of the, this being down here, you open up here, and then instead of the other air being up there, it's opened up here. So now we just need a hose here. Instead of using this hose, the old air hose, I think I'm just gonna do some of this if it's pliable enough. Uh, this is the old hose that the dead man was on. I ended up just taking it off. Okay, so let's... Come around. It's another half inch. I don't ever slow up, no I don't take Got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this I'll always show up I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this I'll always show up and make a statement I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this I'll always show up and make a statement Everything I do, so instinctive and so passionate Every word I move, so descriptive like an adjective I got a vendetta against people who patented Being negative when you should be getting after it 
I got facts over facts over tracks This and that, spitting slow, spitting fast I can roast, I can gas, think I'm okay at last But I don't know if that can erase all the past And the pettiness, a reflection of the emptiness Hilarious, you think you're worth my time, you're delirious Mysterious, because you hide behind a fake exterior Inferior, you know I'll always be a bit superior Get off of me, this ain't no humble brag I want you to hear words, you can say them back I want you to feel free from the chains at last And to believe in what you got, it was built to last, yeah now that I've been put through, I never got anyone's help. I had to do it all myself. I don't ever slow up, no, I don't take. I got no love for the fakeness. If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll always show up and make a statement. I don't ever slow up, no, I don't take. I got no love for the fakeness. If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll always show up and make a statement. I'll be in incompetent Mental health is confidence Dreams and some honestness I'm not here to save the day That's for you to take away I could play a million mind games But instead I say Something not illogical Something that is topical Grab it on and watch it go Make yourself unstoppable Dreams are irresponsible But they're always possible If you just believe You could be so remarkable Thoughts in my head A collage and they spread I'll be great one day Going off of my meds No I'm not giving up No I'm not giving in I will make it to the top Taking off in the wind I gotta make it I'm saving every day to taste it I'm patient, but my mind it can hardly take it I'm chasing a dream that I've had for several ages A vacant, modern kingdom for the taking Now that I've been put through I never got anyone's help I had to do it all myself I don't ever slow up, no I don't take I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough uh, As soon as you put that on, you'll have the weight of that but this is air, got your air, you got your air coming in. We're leaving that quarter inch. Uh, the last part that comes with it, this is the rest of your line for this system. And the end is this. Since um, we are limited on uh, PSI, our tank is 100 and, oh no, 16.8 PSI at 90. Um, we would blow through a lot of PSI, um, except we have an eighth of an inch nozzle inside. So with that eighth of an inch nozzle, that will help us out a lot more. Uh, one of the big things about this kit One of the good things about this kit is it has an adapter for the blast cabinet um, that we will end up getting to where all you have to do <clears throat> so the cabinet will have an end of itself with one of these pieces right here so all you do is you unsnap your airline for outside this one and then the one that's on a cabinet, you just plug out line into this and then your pop blaster does your cabinet too. So it's all about the convenience really. So now that we got this all set, so this is our nozzle and of course the shut off, okay. And the attachment for this end right here Take your pins out. It's just like a normal air compressor any normal air compressor uh, on job sites uh, brand new so it fits tight make sure you put your clamps on boom and boom again go on to the mirror blast uh, website and you'll see the thing called the top kit so this is now your blaster. So instead of reaching down, like if you look at this one right here, you always have to reach down to the bottom to turn the media on and off, but you got your air here, okay? So now this one, 
You are literally. Let me get this up. So as you're blasting, let me unkink it. On. There we go. So as you're blasting, you got the air here on and off, and then your media is here. So it's just like the convenience, instead of bending way down and trying to get under, you're just adjusting your air and then adjusting your media. So that is the Amera Blaster upgrade kit. Um, and like I said, on your website, it's called a tap kit. The tap kit has this hookup right here and then it goes into a hose and it goes into your cabinet with another hose and their El Diablo end or fang end, I don't remember the name of it, but it's a little end. So as soon as I'm done blasting outside, I come up, I unhook this, I hook the hose up, bring it over by the, the blast cabinet, hook the hose up, and now it's blasting in my blast cabinet. Um, if you need to go the cheap way, uh, in the descriptions, all the parts are down in the descriptions if you have a Harbor Freight or if you have a Eastwood. Uh, Harbor and Freight and Eastwood will have this piece right here that goes into the bung will be different. Uh, Harbor Freight will have three eighths and going into a half. Eastwood has a half. If you have a choice, the easiest one to convert is an Eastwood. They're a few dollars more but Eastwood is already set up for a half inch. Um, besides that, we have a couple jobs coming up here. We'll have another video. We've got some rims here that we're, we'll be doing. Uh, we got a grate that a gentleman is turning into a table. Um, waiting on the powder for the stools. And then we have the enamel sink like in the intro that I showed you. Uh, we also have a uh, Garvey coating coming over. Um, we are doing a collaboration on some rims that uh, were messed up. So that will be coming right around the corner here too. So 